वेलकम टू आवर न्यू क्लास एलजेब्रा क्लास सेवेन चैप्टर फाइव एलजेब्राइक फॉर्मूला एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन दिस इज न्यू लेक्चर एंड न्यू टॉपिक सो फॉलो द बोर्ड व्हाट इज कॉल्ड फॉर्मूला एट फर्स्ट वी हैव टू नो व्हाट इज कॉल्ड फॉर्मूला देन देन वी हैव टू नो एलजेब्राइक एक्सप्रेशन सो प्लीज फॉलो द बोर्ड एलजेब्राइक फॉर्मूला एनी डिडक्शन expressed by a algebraic symbols is called an algebraic formula any deduction deduction expressed by an algebraic symbols algebraic symbols that means you have to use x y z or 2x plus 3y plus 4z or twice a plus twice b plus 3c this type of thing okay uh symbols is called an algebraic formula you can see here is a plus b whole square equal to a square plus twice a b plus b square so a minus b whole square equal to a square minus twice a b plus b square this is the formula then we have to know algebraic expression or briefly expression please follow the board we have learned algebraic formula now we have to know what is called algebraic expression or briefly expressions please follow the board so what is algebraic expression the meaningful combinations of algebraic numbers the meaningful combination of algebraic numbers algebraic numbers and the operational signs are called the algebraic expressions algebraic expressions so here is an example 2a 3ab and 2a plus 5b etc so what is called formula we have learned what is called algebraic exp expressions we have learned you have to know carefully what is called formula and what is called algebraic expression the meaningful combinations meaningful combination be careful meaningful combination of algebraic numbers algebraic numbers that means 2a 3ab 2a plus 5b is type of number so we have to know algebraic formula and algebraic expressions now we will have to do some maths find the square find the value and show that and prove that prove that we have to do some maths okay so before starting the maths you have to follow the book formula carefully and you have to use some uh, you have to use some corollary okay so then your maths will be uh, very easy okay thank you please follow the board already we have learned uh, the definition of formula and the definition of algebraic expression now before starting the maths of this exercise uh, exercise we have to know three formula for find the square that means a plus b whole square a minus b whole square and a plus b plus c whole square okay so please follow the board you can see here is a plus b whole square equal to a square plus twice a b plus b square a minus b whole square equal to a square minus twice a b plus b square and a plus b plus c whole square equal to a square plus b square plus c square 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca okay so this is three formula for find out the square so before starting the maths this is very very essential for you for find the square you have to be careful here is a plus b whole square here is a minus b whole square here is a plus b plus c whole square okay now please come to the to main point find the square okay we have learned the algebraic formula and algebraic expression and we have learned the three rules that is three formula a plus b whole square a minus b whole square and a plus b plus c whole square now we have to find out a find the square now follow the board we will do now here is number one a plus five you have to find the square 
5 x minus 7 you have to find the square and another maths twice a minus d plus thrice c now we'll do number one number here is number one so start number one therefore your topic is find the square of find the square of. so a plus 5 therefore square of a plus 5 equal to a plus 5 whole square we know the rules a plus b whole square equal to a square plus twice b plus b square you can say here is this is a position and this is b position this is a you have to think this is a position and this is b position so here is a here is b a and here is b now you can say here is a and here is b so a plus b whole square so we will get here is we have got a plus b whole square equal to a square plus twice a b plus b square so this is a and this is b so we will get a square plus twice a b plus b square now you can see a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square here is a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square now we can write we can write here is a square plus 5 to the 10 a plus 5 square that means 5 5 25 so we have got find the square of a plus 5 whole square that means a plus b whole square a square plus 2 a b plus b square so we have got a square and 5 into 2 10 a here is a that here is 2 2 a b plus b square so here is a square 5 into 2 10 here is a here is a 5 square 5 5 the 25 so we have got number 1 we have got number 1 but in number 2 you can see here is 5x minus 7 that means you have to we have to go back in the a minus b we a minus b whole square place come back in maths number 2 we have learned a plus b whole square a minus b whole square and a plus b plus c whole square already we have done one maths a plus 5 whole square now we will do now 5x minus 7 whole square that means we will have to use a minus b whole square formula now follow the board now you can see here is 5x minus 7 you have to find the square be careful find the square here is find the square so square of 5x minus 7 that means 5x minus 7 whole square the same process this is a and this is b we all know a minus b whole square equal a square minus twice a b plus b square now you have to think that this is a this is a and this is b now a square so here is 5x so a square minus 2a b plus b square i have given here is bracket because here is 5 into x 5 into x so if you can say double you have to use whole bracket so 5x minus 5x whole square a square minus 2ab plus b square now break it 5 square that means 25 and here is x so we will get x square here is minus for this we have to use here is minus 5 to the 10 10 into 7 70 x plus 7 7 49 7 7 49 so we have got a minus b whole square that means a square minus twice a b to a b plus b square here is 5x is the a position and 7 is the b position i think you have got it we have done already a plus b whole square and a minus b whole square method but here is three terms you can see here is uh, 
find the square of 20c minus b plus 3c first second and third terms that means if you are interested you can do the maths in two ways first one is using the rules of a plus b whole square and another is we can break it now we will follow the first method then we will do the second method okay now we will do the math number three so here is find the square of twice a minus b plus 3c square of this equal to twice a minus b plus 3c whole square so uh, for easily we can do this math if we think that this is a position and this is b position we can do this and we can do this math using the rules of a plus b plus c a plus b plus c so let's start here is you think that twice a minus b this is a and 3c this is b think that this is a and this is b a plus b whole square let's start start here is a plus b whole square so a plus b whole square means we all know this is a and this is b twice a minus b this is a a square plus here is plus a square plus twice a b 2 into twice this is a and this is b twice a b twice a b plus b square plus b square okay now we have got a plus b whole square a a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square here is this is a and this is b we have got a square a square plus twice a b plus b square so a we have got rules a minus b whole square a minus b whole square now we have to break it again then we will get here is a minus b whole square a square minus 2 a b a minus b whole square a square minus twice a b plus b square here is you can see 2 and 3 c here is 2 so a minus b into 3 c so 2 into 3 c that means we have got 6 c into 2 a minus b here is 2 3 is a 6 here is c here is c 2 a minus 2 a minus b plus 3 c whole square 3 3 is a 9 3 3 is a 9 c square so now come to the ending point come back we have got here is 2a whole square we have got 4a square 2 to the 4ab we have got 4ab plus b square plus b square 6 into 2 plus 12 ac plus minus a minus 6 bc 6 bc here is plus 9 c square 9 c square we have got the uh, 2 a square whole square equal to 4 a square 2 to the 4 a b 4 a b here is b square here is b square 6 to the 12 a c and plus minus minus 6 b c 9 c square so already we have got the answer if you write this maths up to this this is also answer we can rearrange the maths also we have got 2 a square 2 a b plus b square into this plus 9 c square now break it we have got 2 a whole square that means 2 to the 4 a square we have got 4 a square minus 2 into 2 into 4 2 to the 4 a b 4 a b plus b square now break it 6 to the 12 
AC, AC plus minus minus 6 BC, 6 BC and 9C square. So this is also answer. If you are interested, you can rearrange the maths. So please come back and follow here. So if we rearrange, we get here is 4 A square, all square. Uh, then we will write 4 A, B, B, C, C, A as you wish. Here is 4 A square plus B square plus 9 C square minus 4 A, B plus 12 A, C. 12 AC minus 6 BC. This is also answer. So this is the first method we have done. So if we are interested, we can do the second second math second method. That means using the rules of A plus B plus C whole square as you wish. Okay, we can do the math in a breaking way. Just first uh, first two we have taken A position and second one is the B position. Okay, let's start in second method of this map. We have done a plus b whole square, a minus b whole square, and a plus b plus c whole square. But if you can see the three terms a plus b plus c, uh, we have done few minutes ago. Uh, first, uh, first two terms we have taken as a a, and second term we have taken as a b. But we can do the maths in, in this method also. Please uh, follow the board. Find the square of a twice a minus b plus 3c. Here is 2a minus b plus 3c. We know the rules a plus b plus c whole square. That means a plus b plus c whole square equal to a square plus b square plus c square twice a b twice bc plus twice c a. So here is if we convert into plus then it will be easy for you. So here is minus b, I have taken here is plus, plus minus a minus. So we have got here a plus b plus c whole square. Using the rules, we will get uh, this is a, a square plus b square plus c square plus. You can see here is 2ab, 2ab. This is a and this is b, 2 a b plus 2 b c 2 b c b c plus 2 c a this is c and this is a 2 so we have got a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 a b plus 2 b c plus 2 c a now 2 to the whole is square minus here is square so minus minus a plus b square 3 c so we have got 9 c square minus plus a minus 2 to the 4 a b 4 a b minus plus a minus 3 to the 6 b c here is plus 3 to the 3 to the 6 to the 12, here is 12, A and C. Now, we have got, here is A square plus B square plus C square, 2AB plus 2BC plus 2CA. So, 2 to the 4 is square minus here is square, oh, we have got B square, 9C square minus 4AB, 6BC, 12AC. So we have done a plus b whole square method, a minus b whole square and a plus b plus c whole square. We have done three methods. So after completing this chapter, this is very important topic for you. And if you have any query for about this mathematics or this exercise, you can talk to me in the, in the book number. You can see here is a number you can see, you can talk to me. So. Uh, you can share, you can comment, or you, uh, and you have to subscribe our channel for this. You can see our lecture in the next topic. Our topic will be uh, find the value and show that and prove that. Thank you. Thank you all.